You're so wet. Oh yeah, baby, I was thinking about you. No, I just took a shower. Normally I shower once every two days, but here in Virginia, I feel gross if I don't shower every day. Wow, what a sexy thing she can do with her leg. Did you guys see that? Look at this. Is your grandpa like in the new chair? I think he loves it. I hope so. He can't speak very much, but he always goes like this. Hello, Flexi. Welcome. Oh yeah, Renegades? Hello, GB Shady G. Welcome. Underground heart gonna buy. I just sold my kale. Wow, that sucks. I just sold my kale. I think I still take it. I'll get. I'll just get a kale back. Okay, I can afford one roll. Kale. Oh. Okay. I. Uh, if I don't hit a kale here, I probably just lose the game. Dude, I didn't have any two stars, so I didn't want to try for a win streak. So I was like, lose streak underground's my best play, but I fucking sold the kale for frontline because I thought I could play for a win streak. Okay, I feel like I've already lost the game. I mean, maybe I'll hit like 500 ground really fast and make up for it, but like, I'm already playing from so far behind now. I rolled two gold, and I don't have underground ticking. Oh god, even worse is if I accidentally win this round. I'm gonna win this round. Oh my god. Okay, please give me like Ezreal Sona Kale in one shop right here. Here's the Kale. Okay, down to throw this round. Down to throw the round and make 20. And then on Carousel, I'll literally like just take any, any Sona, any Ezreal. Okay, I mean, maybe it'll work out. I feel like that random Renekton 2 actually helps me out a lot here. Oh God, I'm so sad. I really blundered the game away. I feel like I should not have considered Underground Heart once I already sold the Kale. I should just re-rolled and try to play around whatever else I could get. Why not put Kale in the front? There's no way I'm gonna win the round. Might as well try to kill one unit. All right, come on, give me five underground right now and it's actually still firstable. I'm basically playing like, I'm playing two gold down and six underground vaults down. And six is quite a lot. Like that's the difference between making it to the next threshold of underground and not making it. But I mean, still doable. Underground's very wild. All right, Sona on Carousel. Okay, Ezreal, Ezreal. I don't even care what the item is. I could do something very interesting. I could actually like try to try to win streak. And when I say try to win streak, what I mean is just like save HP, play my strongest board, slam a sunfire. I will not die if 
Yeah, I'll at least let my Sunfire on, on Renekton. Okay, and then I'm also down to summit BT. BT has quite a lot of use on late game units, so I'm down. You want to make 30? I'd have to sell Renekton to make 30. Like, you could, and then just take full losses. I would rather play the Renekton and save like 2 to 4 HP every round. You're like, it's basically the conversion of like, do you want to trade some gold for HP? I guess this battle wasn't a good example of that though, I got owned. I only killed one unit. How many first places have you had today? I'm 8 minutes into the stream. <laughs> oh, this guy's kind of weak. Oh, that's really awkward. This guy is weak, which is really bad for me. Because I want to play my strongest board so I don't lose too much HP. Actually, I, I think he'll beat me anyway. Sell your Renekton. No. And there's a 2 out of 3 chance I face someone strong, and I'm going to want to save HP. I mean, who knows? They have, the, they have Blitzcrank, so maybe I won't even kill that many. But like, when you play underground, a lot of times you're like, man, if only I had like 2 more HP. So then, like, playing this Bloodthirster Sunfire Renekton could actually make that diff. Oh, I killed two units. Let's go. Is there a world where you roll for Sona? Uh, I think there's a world where I early 7 and roll for Samira Sona. I don't think I take that. Yeah, I could see a world where I roll for both of them. Alright, so let's just build a bunch of generic items, like Hodges, Last Whispers. Stuff that will work late game. Oh, oh, f I'm so bad. I was, I was 100% supposed to either pre-level or buy that Kai'Sa. I'm slow, dude. Maybe you get Samira Hero Augment here. Oh, I would nut for a Samira Hero Augment. Uh, I think I'm just gonna slam this Shojin, try to save HP. Oh, this guy's kind of weak. Or is he weak? I think he's weak. I might just slam Shojin just to save HP. We'll see what our Augment is. Keep the least in because he synergizes with Sona. Do you have a new favorite champ of this set? Uh, I like Jin a lot, but he's very popular right now. Oh, is this a free win or a free loss? This is the not even a loss territory? Let's go. Wait, this is a loss, right? This is a loss, right? This is a, this is a loss, right? Oh my god, imagine I get Samira. I, I gotta try for it, right? I don't know with two traits if you can get tailored, but we should keep trying. Oh, I don't, maybe, come on. Oh no. All right, last try, Samira. Oh my god. Oh my god, and a Sona. And a Sona. Are you kidding me? How perfect is that? Wait, I just hit six underground just like that. On my last reroll, Samira Hero Augment and then Sona in shop. Wait, now I just gotta like do whatever I can to save HP and then go like actually like level six, level seven underground. Like I don't even care about win or lose anymore. I just like don't get owned. Thank you, Barkin. All right, we continue. We continue. I don't need 19 gold. I kind of want to play my Lee Sin earlier because he's Brawler and Heart, but Renekin's a two-star. And also, like, my value is not going to be coming from... Oh, I'm the only one with Samir Hero Augment. Okay, let's go. This could actually be the game. All right, let's get a Samir item here. Uh... I would say Gunblade, but honestly, we probably need to secure damage first, just to kill units, so probably IE. Okay, that Misfortune just one-shot my entire board. What? One-star Misfortune at 
Jeweled Lotus, Bunny Mercenary. Imagine Last Dead next augment. Unfortunately, Last Dead can only be offered as your second augment. It would be very OP if it was the last one. Yeah, it's either Giant Slayer or IE, and I think Giant uh, I think IE does more damage overall. I think Giant Slayer does more damage to frontline, less damage to backline. And then IE is just good damage overall. I might level to 7 to try to save some HP. Like, my board's pitifully weak. Okay, down to roll like... I'm down to roll down to 20 just to try to save HP somehow. Whether it's from an upgrade or something else. Oh, that's gonna save some HP for sure. I was thinking like get a Vi 2 or something, but I will not complain about this. Okay, I don't think Warwick's actually good here if you're not gonna itemize him. I feel like he's one of those carries that like, if itemized, is very strong. Oh, what a good loss. What a good loss. Oh my god. No, we keep going. Continue the heist. We keep going. Deeper. Oh my god, dude. Six underground. Speed run. It doesn't even matter that I lost two rounds earlier. Or failed to have underground in for two rounds. Hello, blue run. Hello, Shabura Boru. Okay, at this point, I should probably start spreading out. Lots of AoE coming up. Oh my god, I feel it! Look at this loss! This is a good loss! This is a good loss! I'm gonna get like a one unit loss, baby. Let's go! What a light, what an L! Tacticians, wait, what level is this? Four? Oh, I'm gonna continue. I've got 37 health. One more, one more. One more is fine. One more never hurt anyone. Was that level 4? Tactician's Crown and- That was like- That looked really powerful for a level 4. Oh my god, wait. Wait a second. Wait. Okay. Let's just have everyone else die so that Fiddle can get really strong and save me some HP. Archangel's Fiddle, he's cooking. I have probably take the next one out though, because it takes a lot of time to process. Not, not too bad. Just a five unit loss. That's not even a loss! That's not even a loss. That's not even a loss. Okay, so now that I'm at 8 out of 10, I can actually drop down to 3 underground. So let's actually play for real now. We'll probably go down to 20 HP, take a small loss here. Stand United. No, no. Well, actually, it's, it's probably Stand United. No, no, no. Underground Soul. Uh, I'm done for Cybernetic Implants. Because I'm about to have a billion items. You're underground, let's get ready for cash out. Um, you probably don't play Viego here. 
All right, can we can we get a better loss this time? My board's still not that great, but it'll it'll get really good soon in like two seconds. Oh, fiddle fiddlesticks do be cooking. Okay, some HP saved. Oh fuck, I'm still at one life though. Fuck, if I kill this Fiora, it's literally one HP Fiora. Oh, all right. I was hoping I'd be at two lives. All right, just take whatever it is. I didn't have time to think about that. Please don't lose here. Tell me my team's good enough. I didn't hit Samira too. Come on. Come on, Fiddlesticks. Okay, I'm alive. I, I need to hit like at least a Samira here. Wait, am I? Did I lose? Okay. Whew. Okay, I might be trolling, but I think because I have cybernetic in implants, just like TG, TG, TG on everybody is really good. Come on, give me one Samira. It's not bad. My Mecha Prime Garen has one item though. Uh, okay. And my Samira has Radiant QSS, but she's a one star. If I if I had 14 HP, I'd feel very safe here. But I'm pretty sure if I take like a three unit loss, I'd actually still die. I think I have to keep Donkey rolling until at least Samira too. One nice thing about this is the with Underground Heart is you you still keep getting components. I actually like, yeah, I don't feel safe until I hit this. Let me scout. How many Samira's out of the pool? Like zero, actually. Nobody in the game is playing Samira. Frustrating. Uh, I didn't scout for Hacker Man, so I'm just doing this really quick. I think I'm supposed to move the BT from Fiddle to Garen. Oh, no, I'm definitely supposed to. That, that should be my item remover. Okay, my board's really good now. Uh, the, the fact that I'm perpetually at one life, though, is kind of terrifying. Hello, Shaco TP. All right, let's try to get a three item Garen. That's super important. If you're playing Mecha Prime and you don't three item your, your mech, you're like throwing the game. Okay, that's a redemption. All right, so let's see. Oh. Gargoyle, probably. Gargoyle, redemption. Blade. BT on Garen, Archangel's on Fiddle. And then everybody everybody on the team has an item, so I'll just like wait and see what my next component is. 
No Lost Whisper is really scary here. I think I'll be fine. I've got so much damage. I've got, also got magic damage from Archangel's Fiddle. Okay, this is why I had the, the Fiddle in the back. Defend against the hacker dogs. Although, admittedly, if that went straight onto my streamer, I'd be shitting my pants. I think I win here, though. I need to scout every single round. I always get lazy. Alright, I guess we just try to go 9 now. We're really strong. Like, this Samira's like unkillable as long as she doesn't get hacker dogged. Actually, you know what? I can probably clump because I've got QSS. I've got the quickest. the QSS. The QQSS. Yeah, I have, I have the, the QQSS. I can clump just fine. This shields her for the entire fight, so like, who cares if you're clumped up? One guy had hacker, but I don't think he was playing it. Okay. Okay, then I don't need to clump that hard. Okay, I actually think I first placed this game. I don't think anybody can beat me. I like barely made it in time, but I... Hitting that Samira 2 and like reasonable items on my Garen, I think it's unlosable now. My Garen you cannot kill. At least not without like a lot of time. And my Samira actually does a lot of damage. And she heals the Garen. And if somehow all else fails, I have Archangel's Fiddle cooking every single round. Pretty sure we're safe to go 9. And then, uh, yeah, yeah, just take, give me this. Just get Econ go 9 faster. I prefer an item component, but this is fine. I won't complain about 8 gold. What was my cash out? Uh, I don't know. I just took it quickly because I was going to die. Fawn and items, I think. Oh, look at my Aatrox items. Giga Chad. What the heck? Just rolled best in slot. Did they make Samira stronger without Sure Shot? Not really. I mean, Samira 2 with three good items is pretty good even without Sure Shot. Uh, something that I've noticed, like, I took Ascension one time, and I was like, this augment's literally useless. Fights just don't go long enough for it to matter. So scaling items like Archangels and Sure Shot and Gwinsu's, like, just don't make sense to me anymore. Like, this Archangel's Fiddle I just slammed because I, I, it's all I had and I needed to live. Like, I don't think Sure Shot's important. I'll go Ultimate Ezreal at 9, but I'm not gonna, like, give up one of my slots. I'm not gonna play it over a Ribbon. Wait, I almost lost. Wait, this guy almost beat me. Huh? Oh, wait. Sure Shot's bat is perfect, actually. Yeah, Sure Shot's bat is perfect. Now I don't have to give up a slot. Oh, you know what this remover actually could do? This allows me to swap to a Leona late game. I can move the items and then... Wow, wait, no, this this remover is really good. Didn't even think about that. Why do three defenders? Uh, because... Oh, my level 9 unit. I have three defenders because... Uh, this Riven 2 was like all I had in the moment. If I get a better legendary, I will play that instead. Alright, is there any like positioning traps I have to be scared of? I feel like I win all these fights. I can just stay exactly as is. Uh, Hodge Fiddle. It was like, do you want more tank items? I already have a billion. It's probably a Hodge Fiddle so you do more damage, even if just a little bit. Yo, is it just me or are these fights kind of close? I don't feel as safe as I I feel like I should be. I feel like I'm still like kind of barely pulling it. That came down to like the fiddle. I mean, I could be a degenerate and go 9 right now, but there's, there's no way I, I have to, right? Okay, dodge the Zephyr. Like, I think there's a small chance I actually lose here if I like get really bad fire RNG. But I was looking at these boards and like, nothing seems too intense. Also, I think if I get a one unit loss, I still survive. A one unit loss is actually optimal because it buffs my whole team. Oh, wait. Uh-oh. Uh, come on, Fiddle. Come on, Fiddle! Oh. Oh! Oh! <laughs> The Archangel's Fiddle Clutch! Wow. 
Holy crap, what a terrifying round. Okay, now I feel a lot safer. Because I, I just get Ezreal items now. Oh, it's actually probably just TG. Yeah, it's just TG. Now you for two-star Leona. And fiddle. Am I ever playing... I don't need to go for Aatrox. Am I ever playing um, Echo? Echo over... It's probably Echo over Aatrox. Oh, Echo over Riven. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, Echo over Riven first. Alright, now with this 3 sure shot, I'm so much stronger. Fight's are actually lasting quite a while because I'm so tanky. Okay, look at that Hodge Fiddle going straight to the back line. Pog. If I get two star Leona, I'm gonna move items over. Oh wait. I'm pretty sure this is better. Does anybody not have cybernetic? Everyone has cybernetic, so we don't need to apply the glove. I'll wait for underground to give me another component and then I'll figure out what to put it on. Maybe it's like a JG fiddle. Okay, so now I can't transfer our items over to Leona, but it's fine. This Garen's doing a good job. Also, there's like this saying of like, if it's not failing, like don't change it. If I change to Leona, maybe like there's some weird interaction that Garen had that was keeping me alive and now I just like ruined it. Oh yeah, where they say, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. I am a robot. Hear me roar. And it's not like I'm gonna have a second chance. I'm not gonna have time to lose and then fix it. Okay, I don't think Nuna's worth here. I... Uh, I have AP Samira. I have full AP Samira. It's fine. I'm pretty sure Ezreal like 1v9s this. So much AoE damage. And then just in case I have the ultra late game insurance. This guy's this guy's Nico rolled hat hat. Not good enough. Hello, Tag Moosin. Hmm. I was thinking it could be Giant Slayer Fiddle. I think it's actually BT Fiddle. It's basically the end of the game. Let's just sell. Alright, here you go Vi, here's a glove. Now that's now that's the end of the game and I know I'm not getting a component. Oh, what a successful underground game. It was so scary when I took it and then I didn't hit Kale and then I rolled and then I didn't hit Kale. But thanks to that very lucky last second Samira Hero Augment, everything is A-OK. -okay. Wow! What were the odds of that? <laughs> Last roll- wait, this guy's got two fawns? How do you have two fawns? Wait, this guy's gonna give me a run for my money. Okay, I think Fiddle's gonna need to get involved a little bit earlier than this. Alright, how the hell do you have two fawns? 
This guy's playing 10 units at level 8. Let's get it. My BT, my BT Hodge Archangel's Fiddle is going to just heal to full and CC everybody like twice. I've got way too much AoE damage. It doesn't matter if you have 10 or 200 units. I'll kill them all. And Aegis is definitely busted, because everybody in the game runs AP now. Wow, nice first game. I've definitely seen that, like, two-thirds of every lobby is all AP. Interesting. Alright, already almost diamond one. <laughs>